What's up, everybody? Welcome back to uh, the opinion spot. Um, and for this installment, I wasn't gonna do this this installment for a while, but I said, what the heck? Let me do it now. Um, and this is about friends here on YouTube. Um, I mean, wow. I mean, the friends I've made on YouTube, I gotta just say thanks. Thanks. And show much love and respect to all of them, you know. And I'm gonna I'm give you a couple that I, um, I'm gonna talk about right now. And for all those that are not friends of mine but are listening, I urge you, I urge you to check out these guys' pages. These guys' channels, I should say. And the first one that comes to mind would have to be uh, Ass Kicker. 202 um this guy is to me is just as much as a comic fan as I am uh this guy to me is also just I don't know he's just he just comes up with so so many great videos that I watch as, as soon as he he uploads one he, uh, he uploads one I'm there watching it you know and you know he'll, he'll bring a lot of attention to a lot of the major the great uh, you know the great crossovers that DC and Marvel has for example like he's doing right now the uh, he's doing the, uh, the Avengers in Justice League and by doing that he he, he he also takes you to back to like remember these he also gives you the question like remember remember these great crossovers in some way it's like saying to in my mind it's, in my opinion it's like Asica is saying like whatever happened to these great crossovers why don't they do more like this and for that I always say you know you know he, he does great work and speaking of like great work I gotta go to uh, another good friend, another friend of mine, and subscriber is uh, Brandon Hex 101. There's another guy that does almost a similar things between the that ass kicker does, and these guys seem like they almost they go back and forth. It's almost like there's a battle between them, and I'm just trying to keep up with them. Um, but. Those two guys, like I said, are just great. Um, I'm always watching their stuff. I'm always leaving comments just saying, yo, Kicker, that was great. Yo, Hex, that was nice. You know, I, I ask them questions about comics and stuff, and they'll give me answers, you know. It's, and that, that's the kind of, that's, that's cool to me, you know. Um, a next friend I got to talk about because he's the guy, I guess, in some way he kind of gave me a nickname. <laughs> uh, <laughs> it's kind of funny, but I, I've come to accept that, you know. And that's Dr. Doom Fate. And I urge you to check out his stuff as well. Um, check out his channel. He's 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 cool. He's he's fresh. Um, and he gave me the the name the Living Weeklopedia. Now at first I was a little like I don't. I don't think I deserve that because I'm I guarantee there's somebody out there that know more about a certain character than I do but here's a guy that came on didn't have to do it went on one and wrote something about me and was basically telling people I urge you to go look at Mount Vernon kids channel come out and, and just he, he didn't have to do it but he did and just told him he, here's a guy that put so much emphasis and put so much energy into his work basically by making you understand who the character he's doing a tribute to is and I always said to him I always wrote him yo thanks for that and Doc if you listening man thanks again another guy I want to talk about and I made friends with because I ex actually sent him a video of mine and he was in some ways in his mind he was hooked and that's random, no sense, nonsense, 2K8. 
this guy, and I thought I was a fan of Green Lantern and Batman, this guy buries me. This guy seriously buries me. And when this guy comes out of the video, I'm always watching it and just, just like, wow, you know, this guy does a great job. And we here we go back and forth again, leaving comments on our pages like, I asked him a question about what other superheroes he like, he, and he come back with me, he asked me the same question. And it's so cool because in his page, in his channel, he has, he made the actual Green Lantern uh, symbol and put fan of Green Lantern. And he's not the only one that did, did it. There's a guy called, um, there's another one of my friends called Spidey Green Lantern. His page is nice as well, and he has the same symbol. And then there's another fan, friend of mine called GL Crow that has the same thing. And I'm like, wow, that must took a long time, but I, you got to give it up to these guys. And I, and I give them much love and respect for that. Um, and then, you know, there's, there's just two friends of mine that just seriously always, always leaving comments. And I'm always talking to them, too. And one of them is... Um, you probably heard me say this name before, and I urge you to check out his channel as well. Is Sniper Master 654? I definitely urge you to check out his channel. He's another guy that is just cool to be around. You know, he 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 asked for some help with a certain uh, tribute that he was doing, and I was glad to help him with it. You know, he he sent me some things like yo yo. Uh, can you help me with this? And I'm like, no problem, you know. And then there's, and then there's Metal Ninja 2 David. And he's another cat that is just so fun to be around. The next tribute is a, a request that he put in. And so, I'm not going to tell you who the tribute is about. But if you want to know, then you just got to go check out my latest tribute to find out. But I'm definitely working on this next tribute for him. Um, and uh, hopefully it'll turn out well. Uh, and then I, I can't forget about like the, the female friends I made up here on YouTube. And one in particular is the amazing Wonder Girl. You guys, you guys got to check out her channel. She has her whole channel decked out in Supergirl. And it has all the like incarnations of Supergirl on her pages, and and she's just cool to be talk to. And I met her because she she uh she subscribed. She just wrote me and said she liked my channel, and I wrote back and said back at her, you know. And then and thus that's where the friendship came in. And then there's uh I hope I'm not saying this wrong, but then there's uh, um. Pole Pin Chick, and she's just cool to talk to, you know, if, you know, sometimes, you know, if, you know, I just go to her channel and just ask her how she's doing and stuff like that, and, you know, she'll come back and say, I'm cool, how are you, and stuff like that, and, you know, she's just a real cool person to talk to, and then there's, uh, go down there, 619. She uh, she actually came to me through. Uh, she wanted uh, one of my tributes post uh, as a video response in one of her videos, and I was glad to do it. I'm always open to do anything like that for anybody. And um, she she's cool too. She she deals in a lot of the she does a lot of costume work. And let me tell you, the costume work that I've seen on her pages and things like that are just great. Um. And then, you know, guys, there's a, a friend of mine that, I, I don't know if we fell off or not, but if you're a, a, a subscriber to this guy or a friend of this guy, um, I could really use you guys' help, especially if to all my friends. This guy is known as Rant Raven Affection. And somehow he blocked me and my little brother, Hulkland93 from his channel and I and I've been trying to get in contact him 
to ask him, yo, why, yo, Rent, why'd you do that? But unfortunately, you know, he hasn't really contacted, he, I'm, since I'm blocked, I can't get through to him. So if anybody could contact him, Rant Raven Affection, ask him, yo, why did you block my Vernon kid and his brother? I really, I really appreciate that. But other than that, to all my subscribers and other friends, I just want to say thank you. And you keep doing your thing, I'm going to keep doing my thing. We can coexist and we keep writing comments in each other's videos. And uh, just uh, keep it real. Stay tuned. Later.